Well, I'm a thoracic surgeon. That means a chest surgeon. I head thoracic surgery here at Michigan. I've been a faculty member here for 38 years. And uh, at the time that I was in my surgical residency at, at Johns Hopkins a million years ago, uh, cardiothoracic surgery, heart and chest surgery, was uh, the heart part of that was just coming of its own. Bypass surgery was beginning. Uh, chest surgery uh, was, a, was a fascinating part of that. And it was the challenge of doing big operations, uh, tremendous anatomy, tremendous physiology, and being able to affect a fairly dramatic change in people who had uh, very major health problems and uh, having a, a tangible effect very quickly on patients. I would like to think that, uh, that the fame of our, of our program is based exclusively on this transhiatal esophagectomy operation that I've developed and refined over a, a long professional career. But in actuality, uh, there isn't anybody who just operates uh, in, the, in the absence of their team and gets results. So from the operating room nurses who have posted in the operating room the step-by-step -step process of what we're doing next so they know what instruments we need, to the nurses on our floor in 4C who have charted out the day-by-day -day progress of what's supposed to happen each day with diet, with tubes, with activity, um, to the way we uh, interact with our colleagues in other, in other disciplines and our multidisciplinary uh, clinics, the exchange we have, uh, it's, it's all part of, a, of an incredible team approach. I think it's the Michigan difference. It's the quality of the people that we're working with that, that makes us uh, who we are. And it's, um, it's um, something that's pretty hard to, hard to duplicate.